Hey Mark, I spoke to Ashley earlier. My name's Scott Walker and I wanted to shoot over this quick video showing some tips and tricks that you guys can do in-house to boost your business using your website and Google Business Profile. I would appreciate to hear your feedback on the video and I do hope that this these strategies are helpful and educational for you as well. So here's your website right here. Um, I do like your logo and how clean and uh, professional your website looks. I do really like that you have a way to convert a customer right here. But one thing I would really recommend for your website is to add more content. The reason I say that is because Google loves to see content. They want to see 1,500 to 2,000 words just on your homepage. And throughout that content, you want to be found for buyer intent keywords uh, that are found in Google searches. Like Las Vegas Roofing Company is, would be perfect. It has a location and also a service. Another thing that you could always do is on all your photos, your logo, everything, if you save them correctly um, as buyer intent keywords, that'll count as content as well because it's uh, behind the it's embedded behind the photo for you. So I did go ahead and put your website into a tool I use called Arifs. Uh, this will give me your analytics and kind of show me where you're setting. The DR is the trust that Google has for your website. This is on a scale of 100, and I do recommend that it continuously moves up. Um, you're currently at 2.7 uh, trusts right here, and that's because of your backlinks and referring domains. And just in case you don't know what a backlink is, it's when one website links to another website uh, via clickable button or text. But not all backlinks are created equal. Uh, there are the spammy backlinks, and then there's the authoritative ones. And I do recommend going after the authoritative backlinks by staying relevant to your industry and also your location. Um, and then it looks like you're being indexed for 110 keywords. And this is a third-party tool, so this is a guesstimation, but it looks like you're getting about 400 people to your website, which is pretty good. By implementing the strategies I'm talking about, this will boost your online traffic and also your trust in Google's eyes. So if we go ahead and look at some of the keywords that you're being indexed for, um, you know, Las Vegas roof repair, there's 400 searches and you're on the fourth position, which is really, really good. And it does look like you're being indexed for a lot of good buyer intent keywords by getting onto the first page of Google. So keep that up. Um, and just kind of giving you an idea, just looking at roofing Las Vegas right here, um, you usually get your Google guaranteed ads up top and then you have your local um, ads. And this is a great way to generate business if you ever need it quickly. Uh, but being up in the Google dis, uh, Google business profile or Google map pack is really where you want to be. Um, it's totally fine that you're not there. Uh, there's so many ways that you could get up in the Google business profile. Uh, you could start by constantly be adding reviews. You could make sure that your business name, address, and phone number are the exact same all across the internet so you don't mislead Google. Uh, another tip that I like to recommend that not a lot of people know about is to post branded, geotagged, or geolocated photos weekly to show Google that you're growing your business organically. And then being or and then adding citations, which is your business name, address, and phone number into things like Yellow Pages and Yelp is really beneficial. Uh, because Google is like a big popularity contest, and by giving out your information to as many people as possible, um, it will make Google start to trust you more, and that will boost your business. And that's not only in your local area, but in your surrounding areas as well. Um, and then being up in the Google Business Profile will give you about 30 to 40% of your web traffic, because a lot of people just can click right here on your website. And then for this particular keyword, this is the uh, what I was talking about. And it looks like you're, you know, number three for this keyword. But, you know, the original roofing company is uh, one of your number one competitors. And it is great that a lot of your keywords are being ranked on the first page. So good job. Uh, but looking at their website is right here. And they have a decent amount of content, but not too much. So by implementing these strategies, having more content, um, better keywords, those authoritative backlinks and citations, you could start to, you know, outrank these competitors so you'd be above them. And, you know, it looks like you know what the, the volume is, but just to show you, uh, you know, Las Vegas Roof Repair 400 searches, uh, Roof Repair Las Vegas another 400 searches, uh, Roofing, uh, Las Vegas Rooftop, Roofing Companies in Las Vegas 350, you know, there's a lot of searches for roofers in Las Vegas. So once you start to outrank your competitors, uh, you know, a percentage of this total volume will start going to your website instead of theirs. 
and then a percentage of that will start to give you a call and depending on your closing rate will turn into a customer. So I really hope that this video was helpful for you. I again would appreciate to hear your feedback and thoughts. I do appreciate your time and thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.